Manchester, massive couple of days ahead of us. Jack, remember being here a year ago? It's amazing to be there, great atmosphere. I'm excited to take it all in again. Last time, it was a bad result for us, but this time we have the chance to make it better. We're obviously missing some players. A big loss for us, the MVP, Kamel's picked up an injury. I thought he was the man of the match in the Santa Ana game, so his energy is gonna be lost. We're also missing Victor. Again, injury, but we're fortunate that the Tango League were able to recruit two or three players. This is how we're going to set up a 4-3-3. As we progressed through the season, one of the real positives was some of our build-up play was excellent. How do we take all that and also have a little bit at the top end of the pitch where it matters? Carlos, you're going to play as a false nine. Yeah. In terms of your ability to go past players, different class. You can attract one, two, three, four, five players into you. If Carlos has got the ball, where does he need runners? Behind. Beyond him, coming out here. Yeah. Yeah. The final thing to note is as well that if the game's a draw tomorrow after 90 minutes, it will be straight to penalties. Have a think now if you'd be willing to step up. Take it to penalties, I'll do the rest. <laughs> it's been a special year, guys, and it's a special place. And we're all really fortunate to have one last go at getting it right. Let's go. Before we start the session, joining us from the Tango League London is going to be Held. Hey, this is no entries here, say. Boots looking good, kit looking good. Not sure about the headband, but uh, <laughs> we're going to start with a little warm up. Most importantly, I'm going to be watching you, S. And you've obviously come back from injury. It's not feeling right. You've got to be honest and say it, okay? But let's warm up properly and make sure you give yourself every chance, all right? Let's have two lines over here, then, guys. Good. Dig. Got it. Race, race. Ah! Okay, we're here at Carrington. I'm blowing already. Helgs, Come big on. man. Just excited for tomorrow to be fair. Big game. One touch to start off with. Play! Good feet, young man. I'm absolutely buzzing, but I'm more excited for tomorrow. Hopefully put right what we didn't in Paris and Madrid. I'm feeling good at the moment. I can say I'm at 90 to 100%. I will play with the ball a little bit and then after that, I will see. Hey, so how's the session gone today? Right, the session's been decent. Top what? standard. Look at them. What you doing here? In our session? Spies, spies fam. <laughs> spies. <laughs> Get out. We don't want you here. Like, me and Stampy came in here and we said, look, you guys are actually like pretty decent. We'll leave you here. You can, you can fan us if you want. Cheerleaders. <laughs> Cheerleaders. They can stay. I don't mind no more. It is a big pitch, but we don't need to go and press the whole thing. You've you got to judge it. Can you go? When can you go? Mm. How hard can I go based on what you see in front of you? Like I say or anything, these are guidelines from me. You're the players. You're playing, so you make the decisions, yeah? I reckon hashtag are an effective team as footballers, but if we stick to what we know, we can turn them over, no problem. Our season went well, we got promoted, won the league, obviously, hashtag and that. It's an absolute privilege to be here. I'm so buzzing. As a Man United fan, I can't think of anywhere better to be. This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, so it's something for us to really enjoy and embrace. Tomorrow is my 22nd birthday, so what could be better? Playing against Tango at Old Trafford. I've seen a little bit of a Tango squad. Individually, there's lots of talent and lots of flair. I think where we hold an advantage over them is the amount that we've played together. Pretty evenly matched if you kind of compare the two. We're coming for Tango FC as well. I'm not going to boast too much, but I think hashtag already. How many goals are you going to score? Three. 
Three goals? I'm scoring one. Two Choose goals. one. Two. 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 Only one. How many goals do you want to score? Five. Five. <laughs> <laughs> 20 goals, hashtag you gotta be careful. I'm just gonna get 20 nutmegs, maybe. Let's go for that instead. <laughs> We are on our way to Old Trafford for our final. Pronti concentrati per la finale, mi raccomando. Ti prego di Bit of a dream, what are you boys saying? Ready, Ready for war! Active. That is not too bad. We are finally here. Oh, I like gold. Okay. Go entry. Look at this pitch. Right here at Trafford. Spectacolo. Diego sending it to his mom. Says, "Mom, I made it. <laughs> I'm here." It smells like, right. like panas. What you gotta to say to the fans when you score? Yeah. That means the goal's coming, isn't it? Yeah, you know it. First of all, I'm a United fan. Being here is just crazy. The last time I came here, I was about nine, ten years old. This is banging. I never thought the next time I come here, I'll be playing on this pitch. Hopefully, we'll be lifting that golden trophy at the end of the day. I've been a United fan since birth. You better kill it then. I have to. It's inevitable. Uh, we're gonna. It's inevitable. Trophy's golden like your boots. テレビでしか見たことない、ま、オールドトラフォードにこうやって足を踏み入れることができて、本当に感動してるし。Really excited to get on the pitch and start playing tonight. This is like a dream for so many people, like becoming a reality. So, it's just really cool opportunity. Espero fazer um gol aqui, sair com a vitória com meus amigos. Eu quero deixar minha marca aqui. I'm ready for it. Mike looks like roaring as well. Oh, he's taking it. Oh, he's at the wheel. This one we're picking up late. Nah, it's oh, not to touch it. It's always bad. It's, it's an honour to be here just in general, but on my birthday makes it that little bit extra special. I sat actually in that bench. Not for anything special, just to sit in a bench. <laughs> <laughs> Get to do it again, wouldn't you? Yeah, this is very special, this. It's amazing. Yeah, fantastic. Grab a seat, find your, uh, find your places. At the end of the training session yesterday, we spoke about having to replace a couple of the players that are sadly not with us. So we've got two players who are joining us from the Tango League, and that's going to be Jono and Chuck. As you can see, there's still a couple of places left in the dressing room. So the two players joining us, firstly, it's going to be United legend, played over 500 times, won the league title seven times, and the Champions League, and that's going to be Dennis Irwin. Final player, played for United over 100 times, South Africa international, and that's going to be Quentin Fortune. stuff really. Sometimes he had to think on his feet and if you were losing a game or drawing a game and things weren't going according to plan, this would be the seven or eight minutes that he turned things on his head and we'd win a game. So hopefully our boss can do that today, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I'll try, I'll try. Just following on then from what Dennis said about trying to focus on what we do brilliantly, there's strengths all over that lineup. Looking in that four, in that diamond, if you will, we should all feel really, really confident. Jordan, 
Carlos, Kay, Bilal. If we can get it going and we can play with a little bit of composure and a little bit of belief, that we'll be too good for them today. Spencer here from Hashtag United, pitch side at Old Trafford with the one and only Wes Brown. And we're about to play the Tango Cup, but it is going to be Hashtag United against the Tango Cup. Looking forward, and explodes at halfway. What was going through your mind the first time you set foot out here? A bit nervous, didn't sleep the night before. But I'm sure these will appreciate it. You know, many of them have never played it and will maybe never play again. So I just want them to enjoy it. To be here again is, is very important for me because the first result was not good and that's what football is about and it's nice to be here but the most important thing is that we win the game. Wes, now it's time for score predictions. Tricky, trying to think neutrally here. Obviously I'd love Hashtag United to win. I'm going to say 3-1 Hashtag United. I think you should take the lead early and you should probably end up winning but I think it's going to be closer than that. I think it's going to be something like 4-3. I think there's going to be quite a lot of goals. It's a great game for the neutral and if it is level after 90 minutes, there is the prospect of penalties. Penalty shoot at Old Trafford doesn't get much bigger than that. Will it happen? We're going to find out. It's been an unbelievable two years. Some of the ups and downs, the opportunity that, that we've had in this dressing room to go and experience what it's like to be a professional football player. There's obvious excitement about what you're about to experience. It's absolutely key that you do make the most of every chance you get out there. It all comes down to this tonight, okay? Everyone looks sharp. There's loads and loads of positivity. We have to carry that belief all the way through 90 minutes. Players who are on the bench, you have to be at that belief that when you're gonna come on the pitch, you're gonna make something happen, okay? We've got really, really good players here. Really, really good players here that can win a game of football. All right, come on. It's a shot at redemption for some of the Tango squad after the defeat here last season. A shot at Old Trafford glory for Hashtag United at the end of their first non-league campaign. Both sides are relative newcomers on planet football. Both are firmly in the spotlight tonight though and only one can win. Harry Honesty going to try and find his way past a pacey backline for Tango squad. Sliding challenge by Sidney Bonasco. Here's Lee Hersett. The hashtag on the front foot here. Albie. Go on, Albie. He's done well, and the oh, challenge well, came flying in to stop him. No entry. Downer, who normally is a right back, a left Jack, winger at the moment. Jack Very nice. I've seen him in the warm up, and I've, I, I was saying he looks like he knows what he's doing. Carlos Omabego. 
Oh, yep, can see that coming. That is a Ricky Evans speciality. And now, does Dennis Irwin take this free kick? Does he step up? <laughs> can I shout? Dennis, take it. First Jack test for Central. Jamie Jackson in the hashtag gold, perhaps. Good one. Well Good hand. I mean, it was definitely on target, so you have to give him credit. We both got there at the same time. I think he needs to just touch it a little bit. Like I said, sometimes it's just inches. This is where I think Tango could be dangerous against us, is on the counter. They moved the ball quickly and they're lively. That's a good pass. Well done, Zeus. Great tracking back. Looking for Downer. Now, honestly. Go on, Harry. Can he deliver? Swings it in. Chance! Oh, oh what a goal! He's look at him. He said it. Well, underestimate hashtag United at your peril. He's taking his boots off. He's a Man United fan, Lee Hurst. He's had to wait his, his chances this, this year. He's not always been in the starting lineup. He comes in today. Great finish on the left foot. That finish there, left foot, very hard to caress him. So you've got to tell him well done, and he deserved that. And that'll be a memory he'll cherish for a long time. We've got a player down here, but hashtag That's we're going to play on. Hurst on towards That's Albie it. Keith. He's done so He's well. He's trying to force his way past Sidney Bonasco and turns out to be a foul. Quinton Fortune coming out to the uh, technical area. A real blow for hashtag. Harry Honesty has been really relishing that battle down the left-hand side. Great switch from Tom Williams to find Ryan Adams. And Gets his first touch out his feet. It's a good ball over as well. Diego Batoni just managed to usher it away. Batoni. Basilica caught by the outstretched leg of Ricky Evans. Ricky Evans isn't here to make friends, I'm not going to lie to you. He certainly gave a bit to Ricardo Basilico there. And Ricky's not good at keeping it quiet. Bonasco. Tango squad looking to attack. Basilico. Certainly a little bit spiky in that midfield area at the moment. Well, we thought for a moment Dennis Irwin was going to hit this, but it's Ricardo Basilico yeah, and it's gone kept on going. Chisaka out towards Bonasco. It's a nice darting run. And the turn from Basilico was read neatly by Gleed. Serato decided to wind up and hit it. And we've seen quite a few shots from distance now which have all gone awry. Good Great from Charlie Morley. Oh, he fancied it. it. He's oh, gone he's for it. Oh. Gone to try and lob Declan McCarthy, who was no slouch in getting back. Serato. Good turn. Oh, he's making waves here. And he's Tango got support. Well, they're not bad. He's gone for the big one. He's well, Bilal Azuz. Great tracking back. And Evans went in strongly on Bilal Azuz. So I think what's happened is Lee Hurst has moved back into centre mid. And it will be Tash sitting in the number 10 role now. Dennis Irwin having to step in. There were certainly some words exchanged there. Yeah, Ricky Evans again is not here. He's not oh, showing wait, the... Dennis is having a little... Oh, he wasn't go. best pleased with what he saw or heard either. Yeah, it's a tough one because you, you want to see players of Dennis's ilk be respected and I want our boys to do that. Oh, here comes a free kick Ooh. which could have tested Jamie Jackson but he was confident it was going wide. Avanti, avanti, avanti. Vai, 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 Brazil. Chance here for Tango. Ricardo Basilico trying to slot it through. Carlos Omavigo. I feel like Tango have been knocking on the door, you know. Neither keeper have had to make a save. That's fine. That's fine. I think that's why we're talking about before the game. A few little tricks, but doesn't necessarily mean anything's going to happen at the end of it. And that's half time. We've seen few goal scoring chances, but we have seen a well taken finish. Lee Hursett providing the telling touch after some really good work from Harry Honesty. A good battle at either end of the field and plenty of battles in the middle of the park at the break. It's Tango Squad nil, hashtag United one. OK, half-time here at Old Trafford. Hashtag United 1, Tango squad nil. Lee Hurst, Man United fan, goal is the goal that separates the two teams. Wes, what did you make of the first half? I thought it was very good. I thought Hashtag started off very well. You know, I, I love a winger who gets at, at the defenders, you know, straightforward, old school. Hashtag have just done a little bit better. You can see they're a bit more organised, great passing, nice and quick passing. 
But just, you know, there's been spells where Tango squad have been slowly coming back into the game. Can they get a few more opportunities? Can they, you know, that final ball, um, get a few shots on target to put a, a bit more pressure on Hashtag? Some individual skill, some brilliance might, might change the game completely. Hashtag at the moment are looking at the team that obviously looking a little bit more comfortable. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say loads. I'm not gonna rally you and motivate you and shout and scream because I think for the certainly the second 25, you've been the best team. You're just making life hard for yourselves. They're lively. They're individually. They're really, really difficult to, to play against. Don't panic. Be comfortable not having the ball sometimes. Okay. As the game goes on, we'll get after it a little bit more if it's still one nil down. But don't panic. Just get set and be ready on that forward pass. If we're better in possession, they will have to start chasing. I think they might lose their shape a little bit. We did a crossing the shooting session on it yesterday. It was about being patient and holding your width. I want to see drive from you. I don't want to kill the game. I want to see you open your legs and drive the ball away from people. Come on, come on. You guys can breathe the It's like we're not listening. Expect some improvement. Come on. Right, get more shots off. Be direct. Yeah, let's just go out there and do what we do best. If somebody's got the ball comfortable, just spread out and they'll cause them problems. Can Hashtag hold on to the lead and get the win? We're going to find out in about 45 minutes. So off we go in the second half. Hashtag with the lead after that Lee Hursett goal. Quentin, you ready to get on? Oh, yes. The Tango yeah. squad maybe you know, look to run into the spaces a little bit too early. And what I mean by that is they, they look to take a man on and then try and take another man on. On comes Quinton Fortune for Tango Squad. Lee Hursett fighting back. Just, uh, I mean, he's done well that time, but sometimes they hold it a bit too much. Great skill. The shot goes flying into the Stretford end. There was plenty of potential in that attack from Tango squad. Great ball. It's a tough one now. He has to take the perfect touch. A tense and tight affair so far. And what have you got? At the moment, it looks like it's going to stay 1-0 to Hashtag. Tango squad are looking to make another change here. Jack Downer is going to make way for Kelvin Suarez Alves. Space here for Gabe Kellum. Lunging challenge, which gives hashtag United the free kick opportunity. Now, Charlie Morley would be wishing he was on the pitch right now because he'd definitely be taking it. Williams. There it is. Oh, Ooh. the keeper actually got done there. I want to see these keepers tested the second half. I want to see some big shots and saves. So we're going to see O'Brien then. Here we are going to see Jordan O'Brien, Tango Squad FC's first female player. Not afraid to get stuck in. Still waiting for someone to really open this game up with a moment of magic. We've got some clever players in Tango Squad. Certainly seems to be a bit of momentum behind Tango Squad now. Good ball, good so O'Brien poked through for Azuz. Omar Vega. Much better from Tango, it has to be said. It is, it's a lot quicker. There's... Oh, the trick's Ooh. around as well. Jacko was trying to get there and... Ooh. Kelvin it was who unleashed one. I think since O'Brien and, and Fortune have come on, they've stepped it up quite a bit, starting to control that midfield. Real energy about them, Tango, that they didn't seem to have in the first half. And what was said at half time, but it's working. Yes. He's in it. Oh, he gets oh, a touch. Down ball. he goes. Never oh, a pen. the referee's not giving. No, he, I mean, he's kicked it into the keeper's hand and they might have had a nudge afterwards, but he was never getting there. Quinn and Fortune, you know, he's changed the game since he's come on. We don't look like we can match them at the moment. Esan Abassi is on for Tango Squad. It's a chance for the regular captain, Esan Abassi, to come on. This is the period of the game where the rolling subs will really help both sides. We're starting to see a few getting oh, tired out there now. Big tackle yeah. needed. No, he's done well. It was dug out well in the end. Well. Be brave, come on, we need a goal, we're 1-0 down. Really haven't done much going forward in the second half. Worries me because I feel like Tango are going to get one. 
heading towards the last quarter of an hour. Yep. A game that we thought might be filled full of goals is still very tight. It's not over yet. Abassi with the challenge. A chance here because his mark has fallen to the ground. Harry Honesty could punish here. Oh, his touch was heavy. Oh, and it was a high challenge on Honesty. Yeah, you can't do that anymore. But Tony in trouble. You can't lunge in like that with your studs up. And it is a yellow card Combination for the Italian. One of the other boys here with the ball. And headed away by O'Brien. Now a chance for Abassi to break. With a hashtag yeah, very that, quickly back into position. Slowing it down a bit. Dennis has always pushed on into midfield. Good pass. Sidney Bonasco taking on his opposite number. Marcus Stamp. Yeah. Boxed in here. He's done well to get the yeah, throw there, Stamp. Well. I, mean, I don't mind that. So what they're doing very well at the moment. Um, Tango squad. Chance. He He's got a shot. Oh, no. it's a heavy touch. Just took himself very wide there, Sidney Vanasco. Well We're not going to keep getting away with that. We're letting too many players run through. A, a good pass or a shot from distance is going to catch us off guard in a minute. Chance. Sidney Vanasco threading it through. Serato on the end of it. it. Oh, oh my God. Plenty of Ooh. venom, but it fizzed right across. At the moment, they probably deserve a goal. Charlie Morley, is this his moment? He's bought new boots, especially for the occasion. Oh, Are they going to the produce the goods? Oh, oh. Certainly made Declan McCarthy squirm a little. It's actually sad to say that's a highlight for us in the second half. Yeah. Move for him. Charlie Morley busting a gut to try and get in there. Oh, good test of the keeper. Dennis Irwin. You know, Tango squad have got to gamble now a little bit and push a few more people forward. Well, oh that's my flying God! Goalwards. What a goal! It is a stunner. Woo. It's been coming. To be fair, it's a great strike. A magical moment for Tango squad at Old Trafford. Top bin. Boom. Too much time given to midfielders. They've come through. And they've been looked promising. I said, a few minutes ago, I said, it's going to happen. It's going to be a great shot from the edge of the box, or they're going to find that, that missing pass. Yeah. And what a strike on the left foot that lad's done. Nothing Jacko could do about that. Look top corner from where I was looking. Oh, and it's, nice. it's a funny one in the run of things, because any point in that second half before that, it would have been well deserved. It's a substitute Kelvin that scored it. Hashtag come back into the game with their subs. Suddenly looks like we're going to score. Can't take it away from them. It's been a long time coming. Lots of hard work behind the scenes for the Tango squad. And Kelvin will remember that for the rest of his life. Tashan Richmond. Right. Oh, 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 swiftly oh, in. You know, he played him in. I no, thought he was no, on. just on. Sydney Bonasco. He's trying it again. again. No, no, no. OK. Can Charlie do a job at right back? Never seen him play in defence before. Good turn. Sidney Bonasco, lovely swivel and turn. Here's O'Brien. Well. Might not go to penalties. Tango oh. can do it here. Paddy Markin. Corner. Ball. Oh. Oh. The last corner of the game. Short. Sure. Most were expecting the ball in the middle. It'll come over now. But oh, that's penalties. That, Woo, penalties after 90 is. minutes, these two sides cannot be separated. A second half that opened up a treat. Saw Tango squad equalise through a stunning strike. And now the match and the trophy will be decided from the penalty spot. Whatever happens now, you should be incredibly proud of yourself. Okay, To be 1-0 down, to go and dominate like that in the second half was brilliant. And that is everything we deserve. The pressure is off you, Okay, because you've done brilliantly already. Deserve. Come on, stay together. Come on. Okay? Come on. It's penalty time now. Let's go, Dick. Let's get it. Yeah. So who can handle the nerves? Who has the technique? Who has the reflexes? Hashtag go first and score. Tashan Richmond gets the ball rolling. Yep, Tashan does very well there. Sends the keeper the wrong way. Perfect start. Yeah, brilliant penalty.
it, bro. You've earned it. Jordan Serato. Yeah. Goes for the cheeky chip and pulls it off. Jacko is fuming about that. I'm telling you, he'll not like that one bit. Yeah, very, very cheeky. This guy, too saucy. <laughs> Walking faith, not by sight. You know how it is. This is their penalty, Dex can save it. Lee Hurston already scored here tonight. But not this time. Declan McCarthy gets the job done. It's a very good save for McCarthy. He goes the right way. and did well to keep the ball within his body as well. It could have ricocheted off him. I said it. Dick, I do keep up. Esan Abassi. Oh, finds the corner. Jackson did his best, but it managed to slip through. Really good penalty there. Say all the things you can say about Tango, they're not playing together as much, and penalties is technical, and they're good at them. Ross Gleed goes for power, goes for goal, and scores. Great strike in the corner. But Jacko is going to have to save one, or Tango is going to have to miss. If Hashtag have got a chance of winning this. They've put themselves in a good position. No entry stepping up. Can they keep the momentum going in the shootout? Yes. No entry! No entry! What a hit that was. Wow. It's another good penalty. Never doubt it. Never doubt it. And it all falls to Triple H now. Doesn't need to score mathematically, but if he doesn't, we'll be in a really bad position. Ideal goalkeeper for a reason. <laughs> Harry Honesty. He has become our penalty taker in recent time. I back him. Steps up, but finds the keeper, not the net. It's another great save. You know what? I wasn't overly impressed with McCarthy considering the big talk he gave before the match. But in the shootout, he is paying dividends for Tango. And Kelvin, who struck a stunner at one end. The chance to win it. Come on. Oh, come on. Come on. Let's go. Wonder Boy. What can he do from the spot? Yeah. He kept them waiting, but he slots it home in style. Yeah. And it's a victory at Old Trafford for Tango Squad. Yes! Let's go! Let's go! Great finish, very calm, and what can you say? The team drawn together from around the world is a team of winners. They held their own, they held their nerve, they are the Tango Cup winners for 2019. A year on from defeat, it's delight for the Tango squad at Old Trafford. We've done it. What a battle. Every player on that pitch worked hard. I'm proud of every one of them. They deserve all of this. Two years of hard work. We lost Old Trafford. We came back crazy. And, <laughs> hey, we did it, you know. We did we it. Did it. I can't take any credit really, I think that they've got to be proud of themselves. I think it's more a testament to the type of people they are and the type of characters they are in a game like that. Just thrilled people get a chance to see what they're all capable of. We refused to be beat tonight. Showed a side of us that we didn't have before. And two penalty saves in the end are just surreal. Old Trafford, can't believe it. È stato, è stato fantastico, un'esperienza magnifica. Io ho avuto la fortuna di provarla due volte, ma stavolta vincere è stato incredibile. Veramente bello qua, ha creato dei sogni, forse si è realizzato uno dei nostri sogni. We would love to have won, but I've got no complaints with the result. I think Tango are deserving winners and they should enjoy their life. I can lift the trophy at captain, that means a lot. And I will call my mother after this and tell her that I think she's proud of me here. A sensação mais incrível da minha vida. E hoje é uma oportunidade dessa de jogar em outro Eiffel e poder fazer um golaço desse e ser campeão com a minha equipe. Não tem sensação melhor, é o melhor dia da minha vida.
no matter what, if there's no more Tango Squad FC as such, the team will remain. We can still meet up, we can still ball, and we can do this for the rest of our lives. <laughs> Don't play games. Welcome to Tango Squad FC. I am your captain. This is the best experience you could ever have. <laughs> <laughs> Final time. It was one of the craziest moments when I first got the Skype call to say that I actually got into the team. See us, we don't play games out here. I've seen the progress of the team. This is just the beginning of Tango Squad. This year, if you want to be in Tango Squad FC, you have to be an MVP. If you get beat, draw a line under it, move on, focus on positive things. Okay! I think we've changed a lot in the past year. I think we're much better now. Oh, good! Go away. Yeah. 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 You want to go? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, crap, 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 crap! Ah! <laughs> Billy, would it be possible just to drop the glasses? No, just I told you. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Swipe up towards Tango Squad MC. <laughs> We're getting off the bus now. Is that how it yeah. is? Oh, we got cut. We failed to walk out of a bus. <laughs> Tango Squad is like a completely different environment. My life's obviously got better football-wise and just generally in my life. Uh, I've got a lot more confidence from playing with Tango. It's been like the coolest experience of my entire life, that's for sure. Every day that I stand up, it's unbelievable that I can say that I play in, in such a big stadium. For me, it wasn't all about who we've met, where we've played. I've much preferred you know, learning from people like Essan, from Sydney, who's came in, Kamel, all the other ballers. There's some really, really great players in there and it's not all about trying to change them and shift Perfect. them into a way of playing, but actually try to encourage them to do what they do already. All these dudes, they're now like some of my best friends. What are you saying? I don't mind it. I can play it. Whoa. I'll play it. It's a shot at redemption for some of the Tango squad after the defeat here last season. We do lose a look. Jack Town is going to make way for Kelvin Suarez Alves. I'm going to go to the Theater of the Sun. Flying oh, goals! Wow! It is a stunner! A chance to win it. He kept them oh. waiting, but he slots it home in style. We did it. That's what we worked like in the last two years about. We refuse to be beat tonight. Every player on that pitch worked hard. I'm very happy, I'm very proud of the guys. Never stop, never give up, and you never know what can happen.